Of course, it's a thrill to play any test match for your country. To play 50 really is quite special. It's a, it's a terrific milestone. Morning Walkers alongside me. Morning. How do you feel about that? That's, uh, that's something that must mean a lot to you. Very happy. Thank you, Izzy. Oh, you know, last night in bed, um, you know, when I thought about it, I, I've got five days to enjoy it. You know, in the rugby, you've got 80 minutes, but I've got five days to, to enjoy this. And, you know, obviously, I'm um, very happy and proud um, to play 50 tests in my country. You've got plenty more to come, I'm sure, but let's go back a few years. I mean, did you ever think you would, first of all, represent South Africa? Was that something you thought you would tick easily? Not really. You know, I had a quite a, quite a slow start to, to my career, and then after that, you know, things happened quite quickly. Uh, a couple of injuries here and there, and, you know, suddenly a door opened for me, and luckily, you know, I, I made use of the opportunities. But, um, yeah, I've been playing now in this great team now for a couple of years, and, you know, hopefully that can continue for, for a couple more. You've got some serious attributes, of course, your height for one, but you are one of the guys that is very respected around the cricketing world. What is your strength? Uh, as you, yeah, I mean, I think, you know, to, to make use of my bounce, um, you know, it's one of the things I, I focus on quite a lot. Um, you know, for me, I've got a, with that comes a little bit of pace. So, you know, I, I use that as my strength. And, you know, I think I'm, I, in a way, I'm, I'm a good of a nice patient bowler. You know, um, coming on now, my role now in, in the team, coming first change, you know, just to, to try and create pressure for the guy striking from the other end. And if it's my day, you know, to cash in as, as well. So, you know, just to be a good partnership bowler for, for the rest of the guys. Has your personality as a bowler changed over the years? I'm getting a little bit old, older now, so they say with age comes a bit of grumpiness, <laughs> but not at all. You know, I think for me, my style of play is just to focus and st stay in my bubble. You know, as soon as I get out of that bubble and lose my, my focus, I don't, I don't know how to do the basics well. So for me, it's very important to, to stay in that. If we look at you over the years and the way you have performed, which at times has been spectacularly, you're not really a rhythm bowler, I guess. It's something you have to work quite hard at. Definitely, yeah. You know, I need to I need to bowl a couple of overs to get that rhythm. You know, I'm not as fortunate as Dale and as Vernet can from 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 ball one. You know, uh, be on the money. So sometimes it, the diesel engine takes one or two uh, two overs to, to get um, loose. But uh, yeah, it's something I work on my consistency, and I think you know I've I've done well so far with that. And what about a highlight or maybe a couple of highlights so far throughout your career? Uh, there's been a couple, you know, the six for uh, I took against New Zealand uh, for me in Wellington. There's uh, tough conditions as well into the wind. Um, you know, I was quite empty in the wicket column, you know, that series and to, to end off the series on a, on a high note was, was, was very special for me. Um, Australia and Adelaide, uh, we had quite a, quite a tough day and, you know, come back to get a five in Adelaide for me is quite special. So, um, yeah, hopefully more now I can kick on and, and get some more. And how special is it for you to be part of an attack with Dale and also Vernon? I mean, two magnificent performers. Yeah, I know it's fantastic. You know, they, they set the standard and the trend up front. And for me, you know, I just need to, to, to follow. Sometimes a tough task, you know, with, with the, the skill and um, the, 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 that they've got. But, you know, for me, it's just enjoyable to see how they operate. And, you know, it's, it's a pleasure. And how close are you as mates off the park? No, very, very close. You know, myself and, and Dale obviously uh, grew up together. Or play, uh, grew up together, if I say in cricket terms, in Pretoria, and then he moved to Cape Town. And Vern, I've always been pl uh, playing with, you know, uh, from back into academy days and also obviously when he joined up the national team. So, yeah, we've got a very, very um, close, close bowling unit. And I guess one thing that must be extremely annoying for you is that if you hadn't run out of batting partners at times, you might have, what, four or five test hundreds by now? I was counting them actually this afternoon, about six. Um, <laughs> but now I'm batting at 11, so, you know, I've actually got fond, fond, fond memories batting with AB uh, the last time we did it. So I think I scored a, a 35 not out before we declared, so I'll take that one. But, uh, yeah, you know, tomorrow's a big day for us, the first session. If we can get another couple of runs on the board, vital runs on the board, it'll be nice. And then, you know, for us to run on the new ball and make the new ball count. And your 50th test, good luck. Thank you very much.